ever wondered where the craziest, most intense places on Earth are? Well, we have a bunch of extreme environments out there waiting to be explored. Some are jaw-dropping tourist spots, while others are downright hilarious. So, without further ado, let's check out the top 10 most extreme environments on Earth. We'll start with the world's hottest place on number 10. So, it's none other than the Death Valley in California. And back in August 2020, it recorded a scorching temperature of 130 degree Fahrenheit, the highest ever documented by the World Meteorological Organization. With its minimal rainfall of less than 2 inches per year and its location 282 feet below sea level, surrounded by towering mountains, Death Valley is like a blazing bowl that absorbs the relentless rays of the sun. Now, after the hottest, let's talk about the world's coldest place at the 9th spot. And it's not where you might expect. While the Arctic regions of Canada and Russia have seen bone-chilling temperatures, the absolute winner in terms of extreme weather cold is found way down in south of Antarctica. In 1983, at Vostok Station, a mind-numbing temperature of minus 89.2 degrees Celsius was recorded, earning it the title of the coolest place on Earth. Another location nearby, Dome Fuji, saw even lower temperature in 2010, measuring at minus 93.22 degrees Celsius, according to satellite readings. Although there is some debate about which measurement is more accurate, but one thing is for sure that you won't survive more than 3 minutes in these spots. Now, up next of the 8th spot on our list comes the driest place on Earth. It's the Atacama Desert in Chile. While there are many deserts around the world, the Atacama Desert stands out as the absolute driest. In a specific corner of the desert called Erica, located in the northern region, a remarkable record was set with the longest dry streak in the world, lasting a staggering 173 months without any rainfall. This arid region is known for its extreme lack of precipitation. However, in 2015, an unexpected event occurred when Al Nino brought heavy rain to the desert, breaking the dry spell. A total of 0.96 inches of rain fell in March, which was equivalent to approximately 14 years worth of rain in just a single day. Up next on number 7, it's time for the world's wettest place. While cities like Seattle and London are known for their heavy rain weather, it's actually Marsanarum in India that takes the crown for the wettest place on Earth. It's situated in the mountainous terrain that funnels the annual monsoon winds and receives a massive 467 inches of rain each year. To put things in perspective, Seattle sees approximately 38 inches of rain annually, while London receives around 23 inches. Even the renowned Amazon rainforest experiences only about 80 inches of rain fall per year. At the 6th spot on our list of extreme places, we have the world's steepest cliff and it can be found on Baffin Island in northern Canada. This cliff is none other than Mount Thor, named after the Norse god. It holds the remarkable title of being the steepest cliff on Earth, with a breathtaking vertical drop of 4,101 feet. Not only that, but the angle of the cliff is a mind-blowing 105 degrees overhang making it even more astonishing. Many adventurers have tried to conquer Mount Thor, but only a four-man team of Americans succeeded in reaching its summit after a challenging 33-day journey in 1985. Next up on number 5, we have the world's hottest water on Earth, which is found deep in the Atlantic Ocean. It's like an underwater volcano called Black Smokers that spews super hot water and chemicals from the Earth's core. This water is so crazy hot that it exists in a unique state called a supercritical fluid. It's denser than normal water but lighter than steam. Imagine temperatures reaching a mind-blowing 407 to 464 degrees Celsius. And that's really, really hot, like way more hotter than a boiling pot of water. And get this, it's packed with all kinds of cool stuff like gold, copper and sulfur. Now next up, let's check out the most remotest place on Earth at the 4th spot. And it's none other than the Tristinda Kunaha. This tiny island is located a good 1739.8 miles away from the nearest mainland in South Africa, making it incredibly isolated. 
With a population of just 270 people, it holds the title for being the most remote inhabited location in the world. Can you imagine living in a place where mail only gets delivered once a year? Yeah, that's what it happens there. Despite its remoteness, Tristan de Cunaha is a part of the United Kingdom and covers an area of around 30 square miles. The residents rely mainly on fishing for sustenance and they eagerly await the annual visits from an optician and a dentist sent by the UK. Coming up next at the third spot, we have the most electrical place. So, it's the Lake Maracaibo in Venezuela, which is also known as the Everlasting Storm. This spot is famous for its never-ending lightning storms that happen almost all year around. Imagine seeing thousands of lightning strikes every hour during a storm, and the lightning keeps flashing for a crazy 9 hours at night. According to record books, there are 250 lightning flashes per square kilometer here every year, and in October you get a mind-blowing 28 lightning strikes every single minute. We're not exactly sure why this place is so electric. But it could be because of the unique air, the mountains, the coastline, or even the methane from the oil fields. Next up on our list, we have the deepest place on number two. It's like diving deeper than anyone ever went before, even deeper than the lowest point in the ocean called Challenger Deep. It's way down there, like a good thirty-five thousand eight hundred and fourteen feet below sea level. Only a few brave explorers have reached this extreme depth in a special submarine with super thick walls, because the pressure is insanely intense, like eight tons squeezing every square inch. It took them a crazy long five hours to make the 6.7 mile journey to the bottom. And guess what? Even down there, there are some cool fish swimming around, surviving under all that pressure. And last but not the least, it's the most toxic place at the top spot. Now you might think that the most toxic place on Earth would be Chernobyl or something, but it's actually Abnogoshi in Ghana. It's a slum area heavily populated by e-waste, like old phones and computers. The pollution here is so bad that it poses a serious risk to the health of the people living there. They work with the waste, extracting valuable metals, but in the process, they release toxic chemicals into the environment. Even the eggs from chickens in this area are contaminated with harmful chemicals. Well, with that, it's a wrap on our list of the most extreme environments on planet Earth. So, which of these spots would you like to visit if you got a chance? Let us know in the comments below. And if you like this video, give us a big thumbs up and share it with your friends and family. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you never miss out on our new content. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you in the next one.